Right now, a business owner is left cleaning up a pretty big mess after a driver crashed into her building and then took right off. Eight on your side's Marco Villarreal joins us now live from San Antonio where this happened. Well, let's give you a look at where all of this happened. This quaint little building right there is a salon. The owners moved in just over a year ago, slowly repairing and fixing things to their liking. Now, they have to add more work to their list. Pasco deputies showing up here July 6th, a couple of hours before midnight, and found property damage right there to the corner of the building. There, they noticed tire marks on the ground. Investigators say 20-year-old Joshua Bihorel crashed his car and then took off. Deputies were able to catch up with him not long after and say his breath smelled of alcohol and he had slurred speech. He told police he had drank a half bottle of rum in two hours. And while at the hospital, deputies had to hold him down and say that he spit on them despite wearing a spit mask. The owner of the salon says people living, near, living nearby heard everything that night. There's several witnesses around here that said they heard like squealing of tires like going down the road. And um, of course, multiple people were up here when we got here. Joshua Bihorel facing several charges, among them DUI with property damage, leaving the scene of an accident with property damage and battery on a law enforcement officer. And the good news, when I talked to the salon owner, she says, thankfully, the damage there, not as bad as they initially thought. Reporting in San Antonio, live right now, Marco Villarreal, 8 on your side.